It's all a good laugh for the studio audience and the rest of us watching at home, but what's it really like to be one of those poor contestants on Family Fortunes making a right old pig's ear of things in front of millions? But to find out, I'm heading to Hertfordshire to meet the Johnson family, who took part in a classic Family Fortunes episode in 1983. It would also be a memorable experience for host Max Bygraves. The big prize tonight is £1,000. The stage was set for factory worker Bob Johnson and his family, who will forever be remembered for a series of strange... <laughs> ..but hilarious answers. Turkey. <laughs> Hello. Hello, the Johnson family. It is indeed. This Hi, is Brian. Brian. He was head of the team. Right, Brian. Please come in. Hello, loves. You all right? <laughs> Are you well? Also Hi, making sir. up the team right, was Brian's, Brian's wife, Hi, Jenny. What's your name? Jenny. Hello, Jenny. Her sister, Margaret, Hi. and Margaret's husband, Hi. Michael. Still and standing. Sadly, Brian's dad, Bob, the fifth member of the team, is no longer with us. Brian, introduce us to the family, please. Yes. This is my wife, Jenny. Jenny, yes. My father, Bob. Bob. My sister-in-law, Margaret. Sister-in-law, Margaret. And my brother-in-law, Michael. Michael, yeah. How did it come about, then? I was sitting here one day, kids are all at school. Mm. I thought, oh, what can I do for, to get some money? <laughs> go on a game show. And I d couldn't go on one on my own. No, sure. So I thought, oh, get one where there's a family. Jenny, you like reading. What, what sort of books do you read? Mills and Boone. Crikey, Jenny, look at your barnet. <laughs> Margaret, you're a housewife, you do anything else. Can I have a Mark, you were very foxy, Margaret, yeah. I'll give you that. Living or dead, name a famous Irishman. <laughs> yes. Disraeli. Disraeli. Disraeli? <laughs> Disraeli? Was he Irish? No. I said I'm What on earth? Disraeli. <laughs> <laughs> it's fair to say the Johnsons were never going to win Brain of Britain. Bob, a famous Irish man. Des O'Connor. Des O'Connor. He no, says Des O'Connor now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but things got worse. Name a famous Irishman. Good. Who? Hemingway. <laughs> Hemingway? Yes, sir. Any famous Irishman? Trevor MacDonald. Trevor MacDonald. <laughs> <laughs> You did not say Trevor <laughs> McDonald. Where'd they get this lot from? I don't know. Mind you, the opposition were just as bad. Huey McPhee. <laughs> so the Johnsons got through to the big money round. The first thing you buy in a supermarket. Uh, bread. A food often stuffed. Chicken. Michael got off to a great start. We've got 131. Go back there. And then, up stepped Bob. Go on, Bob, my son. Hello, Bob. It's nice Hello. to see you sober. Here it is. Here it is, guys. Here comes, here comes Dad. Here comes Bob. Name something people take with them to the beach. Turkey. The, the first thing you buy in a supermarket. Uh, turkey. <laughs> a food often stuffed. Turkey. <laughs> this is the bit I love. Watch. Now watch the shot of you lot. Look, you don't know what. Michael's going. What is going on? <laughs> what was coming into your dad's head? Why was Why was Bob saying? What on earth made him say turkey? Well, when he uh, yeah. went behind the, the scenes yes. and he had all the earphones and everything on. Yes. I mean that was all perfectly all right. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. But when he was being led back, right, he somehow overheard, either from the audience or something that was going on, that chicken had been an answer. Ah. And whilst he was walking back round, he's gone, <laughs> if chicken's going to be an answer, yeah. turkey will be an answer. <laughs> it's got to be an answer. <laughs> Dad's mind is no longer on <laughs> what's happening. <laughs> it's on the fact that he's got to say turkey. <laughs> <laughs> and Max comes out with the very first question. Name something people take with them to the beach. Turkey. What and once he said it, yeah. and he's realised it's a mistake, yeah. he now knows it is another question coming up. The first thing you buy in a supermarket. Uh, turkey. <laughs> and it's wrong again. 
And the third question <laughs> comes up. A food often stuffed. Turkey. <laughs> and he's in. And he was in. You sure. could not write a script <laughs> to come up with that programme. No, exactly. But Extraordinary. It's... Name something people take with them to the beach. You said... <laughs> <laughs> the answer was... <laughs> The first thing you buy in a supermarket, the answer was... <laughs> and the survey gave you... <laughs> 32 years later, you're sitting here watching this. How, how does it make you feel as a family? Are you glad you did it? I am. Yeah. I keep it quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Not much chance of that now, Margaret, is there, love? Oh, you didn't beat the clock, but I'll tell you what, you won £152 doubled, and you can go back to the asylum with the people. <laughs> <laughs> Every time we see it, we have to laugh as well. <laughs> it's, not, it's not something you can watch and be sad. No. You, know, <laughs> you, no, no. you just have to laugh yeah. and laugh with it. Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic.